See, I told you we beat Robert here. Well, I told you that we had time for breath. Honey, why don't you just go home? I'll handle this, okay? It's police business. There's and no need the for you to do it. And the of the lab test? Sweetheart, I told you. Did you get it? Got it. Gordon never wanted to hand it over. What's it say? But I'll open it first. Oh, sorry, we're anxious. Speak for yourself, honey. You were up all night long. You wanted to call Dr. Gordon at 2 a.m. I did not. Come on, you guys. You don't mind if I'm here, do you? Honey, I think, um... um Mom's the word. My lips are sealed. Well, what's it say? Is the water contaminated? The word contamination doesn't do it justice. We're lucky we don't have any deaths on our hands. Really? What's our next step? I want to bring in Brooks. And Bobby? She's next. If necessary. We know? We're all asking ourselves the same question. Well? We don't want to speculate on it. Well, she's our family. I want to find out the truth. Well, I can't believe that she'd be standing around while people are being poisoned and not do anything. One way to find out. How? Guy. Uh, listen, is Judge Wheaton on today? I need a big favor. Yeah. A search warrant? Two. One for Broxton's hotel room and one for his office. What? Yeah. Oh, no, I think I have the right person for the job standing right in front of me. Just tell him to contact me, S.A. Yes, Pigwood. Thank you. Robert, I'm happy I'm involved, but don't you think we ought to get somebody else in on this? Look, listen, both right from the start, one? nobody else. Until we know what Bobby's part is, I don't want any leaks. Well, how the hell do you expect to keep Broxton occupied? Oh, while you were out having breakfast, I uh, got this. Oh, convenient arrest warrant. Is that sure, huh? That's sure. Yeah. Well, well, thank you, sir, for getting back. Well, thank you, sir, for getting back to me so promptly. Right. Uh, no, two warrants, as it turns out. Yeah. Yes, I realize the process involved, but we're dealing with human lives here. Thank you, sir. I knew I could count on you. Remy, I think you know everyone here. Yes, I do. Hi, Felicia. Hi. How's Max? He's great. Good. Remy was with Frisco the night Max was born. Oh, you have my sympathy. Thanks. Funny. <laughs> uh, when is Wheaton going to have those warrants ready? He said they'd be signed by the time you were ready to leave. Good. Robert? Hmm? Hi, how you doing? Mm -hmm. yeah. She's part of this? Yeah. She's going to be your partner. I thought we were trying to keep a lid on everything. <laughs> we are. The investigation <laughs> and you. Well, I thought that, uh, you thought that I was capable of taking care of myself, and I think that I've proven over the few years that, uh, I am. There's no question of that. No officer on this force goes on a search mission solo, and I Anna's going to be with me. Fine, fine, fine. Whatever. Uh, Remy, listen, why don't you get a head start on Frisco and meet him downstairs? Yes, sir. Hi. Now, look, let's not forget we're looking for two things here. Evidence of Broxton's complicity in this Willow Shores business, and whatever part Bobby's got to play. If she is trying to cover something up, it's because she's being blackmailed into doing it. Now look, you might be right, but your husband's gonna have to prove that. Well, everybody knows about her past. They can't be holding that against her. That's right, and now she has children, she works with an adoption business. There's nothing shady about that. I wish I had a few more answers. Maybe Frisco here can find something. Perhaps we'll just get lucky and Broxton will talk. I'm not gonna hold my breath on that. Um, do we even know where the guy is? Are you questioning my thoroughness? Yes, of course. Honey, I think it's time you go home, okay? Are you going to walk me out? Yeah. Bye. Look, uh, I've got some work to take care of here. I'll call you when I want to go and pick up Broxton. All right. It's very difficult for all of us, I mean, not knowing where Bobby stands. That's one big understatement. I'll see ya. What? You... Robert? 
I must say, this is very upsetting. The hotel prides itself on impeccable clientele. This is the first time for everything, huh? The very idea of a search warrant chills my bones. Here. Uh, put it in your scrapbook. And my scrapbook is for weddings and bar mitzvahs and the like. That's what I thought. Mind if I look around? Go ahead. How long will you be here? Well, that depends. What shall I tell Mr. Broxton if he would want his room key back? Well, don't worry about that. Why shouldn't I? Mr. Broxton's not coming back. Why not? He's going to another hotel, smaller room, and better security. Well, now, that's ridiculous. The Port Charles Hotel is the best security in the world. And... Wait a minute. I spoke to Mr. Broxton this morning, and he said nothing about this. But let's see those badges. Um, here you go. And yours? I don't have one. It's my first day. She's my boss. I see. Well, I hope you don't turn the room upside down. You have my word. <laughs> what a hoot! Yeah, I just want this whole thing over with, that's all. Why? Let's get started, huh? You start on that side of the room. Excuse me? Who's giving the orders here? I'm your superior. Your what? Frisco. I was just making a joke. Oh, yeah. So what's the matter with you? You seem like something's wrong. I just want this over with one way or the other, that's all. Okay. Um, is there anything specific of Broxton's we're supposed to be looking for? Not really specific. Just something that ties him to anybody in Port Charles. That's the priority. Yeah, can I help you? Well, I, I'm here to turn on the bed. Oh, it's, uh, it's already been done. Thank you. Thank you very much. Should have asked her to leave the chocolates. Next time. You get anything? No, just an empty notebook. There's gotta be something in here. Tell whoever it is to beat it. Uh, go away. Um, we're in bed. You what? It's Alicia. I'll handle this. Hi, honey. Hi. What are you, what are you doing here? I needed to see you. Well, what is it? What's you know that storm out there is getting pretty bad. There, you should be at home, don't you think? The last place I want to be right now. Back on. So nobody called. Good. Did Max get a whole bottle? Oh, great, great. Yeah. Well, this is it. Not much though. Well, we did our best. Okay, well, I'll call you back later. Goodbye. Are you disappointed we didn't find more? Could have been worse. My first search and seizure. I was kind of hoping we could cover ourselves with glory. Well, the Frisco's not upset you shouldn't be either. We gotta search Broxson's office yet. Well, I'll keep my fingers crossed. No, no, don't touch it. Robert should call right at this time. Jones.